Jump starting a Mercedes Force River Solera. What's that? Do you have any tools with you? Oh, we got it under the under the hood here. No, sir. Hey, everybody! I'm gonna show you how to jump start your RV. Okay, so these little sprinters right here, right? These Mercedes. You want to come in here. You want to pull the little hood release right there, and then come around here, and right above the emblem. You got another little safety switch. This one here. Lift the hood all the way up and the little strut thing bar right here will hold it. And then you have a positive connection here. Push this plastic back and turn it. Exposing the metal there. That's where you're going to put your positive connection. And then your negative connection is over here against the wall. That little piece of metal sticking out there. Okay, so I'm using the NOCO Boost Jump Box. You can use jumper cables from another car. Just hook up your red cables first there to the metal, your black cable here to the negative, and turn your other vehicle on or your jump box, and we'll go ahead and start it up. All right, there you go. Just turn your box off or shut your other vehicle off. Just connect your cables. And to release your hood, just push up and then push this bar back and then let the hood down. And that's it. Another thing, guys, these vehicles have an isolation switch right here underneath the uh, dash by the gas pedal. Sometimes you have to push that little red tab in and pull that connector off of there and let it sit for a while and then put it back on to get the vehicle to start up if you've had it in storage for a while. It's called the isolator switch or isolation switch, something like that. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. That's how to jump start your RV. See you on the next one.